another thing that I want to say that, of course, I can also confirm what Jin Dong said. He was very reluctant to contest in this state election. But the leadership felt that he must lead. So in other words, uh, he has been directed to contest in this state election. So uh, the proposal was come from the central leadership? Yes. Okay, because uh, in the interview yesterday, he, he refused to tell us uh, whose proposal is that. It's a central leadership uh, directive for him to contest. It's a directive, not a proposal. It's not a proposal. It's a directive for him to contest. Meaning he must contest? Yes. <laughs> Which seat he is going to contest? Which seat to be announced later, but I can confirm that he will be contesting. Okay? So that is your headline. <laughs> <laughs> so, I will not announce which seat because that is not my authority to announce which seat that he's going to contest. But I can confirm that the central leadership directed him that he must contest. Because this is, I mean, we, the central leadership felt that as a state chairman, he must be the general leading, leading the troops to face the campaign, to face the, the election war. So, it cannot direct if you are not on the ground. You're not on the on, 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 on the battlefield on the battlefield, so he must be part of the battlefield. He must be part in the, bit, the battlefield, and that's why he has been uh, ordered uh, by the leadership to to contest in this state election. He, he tried to protest. talk to you about protest. <laughs> huh? to talk the uh, out of it, not to contest. No, 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 no. I mean, I mean, not to protest. Uh. I mean, he. I think. Chin Tong is, uh, of course, he, he, has, he has expressed his personal preference. He wanted to focus uh, on the national level. He's, uh, actually, he's more, uh, uh, he's more comfortable to contest at the parliamentary level. So he has never contested a state seat. Yes. Okay? He has never contested a state seat uh, before this. Unlike me, Gong Ying, and uh, Koming, or Chong, uh, many state chairmen have contested both parliamentary and state seat, but not him. He has never contested a state seat throughout his uh, career. So he's always just contested a parliamentary seat. But this round, because of a separate election, that he cannot run away from uh, or leading the force, because it's a separate election, if he doesn't contest, then he was not leading this campaign, to be seen as leading this campaign. So he must be seen as the general leading this campaign, and the leadership felt that uh, he must take the charge take charge and to lead the campaign by contesting in the state seat. It seems like he is very reluctant to accept this. So how are you, I mean, how is the central leadership going to convince him to contest? So same thing as I said, as we said, the central leadership, I mean, if we want uh, those who, who do not, uh, we want everyone to abide, then the state chairman also have to abide by the decision of the central leadership. That's a TAP rule or principle that um, there's no uh, only exceptional case that can contest a parliamentary seat and uh, stay seat together. So uh, does it mean that uh, he's not going to contest in the next round in a parliamentary seat? I think it's still too early to, to make that decision, to, to say that. Uh, I think we take it a step uh, uh, at a time. So, as always, I mean, there, there is, even though there's a general policy not to contest two seats, but there's, uh, there's always exception to be given uh, based on special consideration. So in this case, uh, because firstly, he's not an MP right now. Yes. So the question of him contesting two seats does not arise at this point of time. So whether or not he will be contesting a parliamentary seat, that is <laughs> it's, it's subject to a later decision. Okay? I, 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 this is too premature to say. But as far as it is con uh, I'm concerned, uh, the leadership has directed him that he must take charge. Since he's the state chairman, and we are facing a tough election campaign that uh, he must, he has no choice but to lead the campaign by contesting a state seat. Would it be Skodai? Hmm? Would it be Skodai? No, as I said, the seat, the seat will, not, will not be announced at this point of time, but I can firmly say it's not Skodai. Can, okay. can you just tell us, like, in the Northern... Central no, la, it's okay. La. <laughs> it's okay. La. Leave, some, leave, some, leave some room for other, <laughs> other, others. La. Don't take everything. La. Maybe you can say that uh, whether he would contest in a safe seat or not. No, no I, I mean, there's no such thing as safe seat. Okay, first of all, I mean, uh, 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 we, want to, we, want to, we want to warn all our members that there is no safe seat for DAP in this election. There's no such thing as safe, safe seat. 
even with Skudai, we won by over 30,000 majority. It's not, we never considered and we don't, we don't accept and we don't consider any seat as safe seats. In this election? In this election. Because we know that it is a very tough election battle. So no seat is safe for the DAP. Every seat is a battle. But for, as far as Chinto is concerned, yes, the decision that he has to contest, but not Skudai.